Whoa. Hey, how do you think he cranks that trailer up like that? With a come along? With that crank down there upside down and shit? You can't crank that up. <laughs> Five horsepower arrow motor. Look at this little pulley wobbler. Look at this little 23. What is it? Oh, I have one or two of them. That's what it was built after the headless. Yeah. Because I got one of the headless. I think they only made them three years. I have a little headless too. I had forgotten about it until just now. Oh, you got one? I have one at home. It's a nice little compact little guy. Is it a Fairbanks one? Yep. They only made it three years. I got 15, 16, 17. I'm not sure about that. I haven't really got too serious about it. I have to set down. I have to do it. One of them is a Fairbanks and the other one. Oh, this is a little bit. I like that blue hopper on there. It's pretty cool. It looks like a mirror motor with that on there, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, that's okay. Yeah. That's cool, that baby. Let's show these old timers out of the way. This is nice, man. This is the old time. This is early. 1911, yeah. I love it. I like it. It's got... And then it's, it's kind of thin, isn't it? Yeah, and it's got stuff on it. There's a fuel pump working. Oh, yeah. My mobile has a fuel pump like that on it, similar to that. I had a 5.0. Oh, yeah, those are all. Yeah, my mobile is basically the same, same thing as the engine is. It is. But they did, yeah, there was a difference. I don't know if it was this year or what, but at one point they called it a mobile. And the next thing you know, they called it a type in, but I've never seen them like mix. You know, all the things I've read and researched. I used to research. I used to watch, uh, but oh, what's his name? Uh, 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 South does, Dog Sam? Yeah, Shop Dog Sam. Of the east coast of Arkansas. Yeah, he does you know what he did? Him. He moved to Tennessee. Oh, did he? I'm not sure if I ever knew that or not. I haven't watched him for a while now. I haven't either, but he... So a couple months ago, and he was... Yeah. It took him so long... <laughs> He's not in a hurry. ...to what the subject of his... He's not in a hurry. Oh, hell no. <laughs> I, finally, I never did get to the actual subject of that video. I finally <laughs> turned it. Man, this is a smooth running engine right here. Check that out. Yeah. What year is this? It's uh, 1950. Associated. It's making five dollars a day. That's going take you. That is a super. Look at the wheels. They're not even moving. Nothing moving on it. Cleaned so up, ten stripes. Oh, yeah, they put a little bit in it. But this was worth putting the time into. Six horses. Look at that top of the top. 300. Horses on top and everything. Oh, that is nice. That's some uh, classic fabrication. Uh, yeah, that's when you need to try it. It's nice, yeah. Here's a little uh, vertical. We always like the verticals. Yeah, me too. I, I still regret that I've never done that. San Francisco oh, yeah. is six horses. That's just some buggy wheels, buddy. It's made of Frisco. It's a California engine right here. Yep. Fearless. Frisco, Sacramento, LA, and Portland. Hey, this is a. Uh, it could be a rare engine. It is. It's got the... Over, this got overhead valves. Look at that. <laughs> this thing's running smooth, isn't it? Yeah. 
Oh yeah, it runs a long time. What's this? That's a good question, huh? Lawsuit. What's that? Lawsuit. L A U S O N. S E N. S E N. L A U S E N. He's running it off a battery. Oh, he's got the igniter. Yeah, he's running battery ignition. He's got igniter. You can run these with a magneto too. This may be three magnetos. You know, they made them right around them. Well, three or four. Oh, it does. But he's not running it down there on the mag. That's he's right. He's running it on the coil. Oh, that's cool. Well, you know, it's so much more precise to run them on the coil. Oh, but they trip. It makes them start like 100% easier when you run them on the coil. Coil and rather than the mag, yeah. Yeah, rather than the mag. It's way easier. You don't you don't have to put your timing is all right on this shaft right here. You can set your timing on it wherever you set your alligator clip up there in your igniter. And then there's another wire that runs up that makes contact when that arm moves. Oh it's here. Okay, there it is. And I read something a while back that it was almost impossible to run them on the mag and the coil at the same time. But, yeah. then, but then there was something in there that said somebody was doing it. It looks like this guy's doing it. But it could right. be that maybe he does just use it to start with and then switches it. But he's got the switch closed on it right there. That may be where you switch over to the mag. That, you're right. Yeah, that's what it is.